Hello and welcome to another Nihongo Gamer vlog. Uh, this is a picture that I drew yesterday for Instagram. Uh, it's Marie Rose from D Dead or Alive Extreme 3. And actually while I was drawing this picture yesterday, I discovered a really interesting trick. While I, I think I just placed my fingers on here by accident, and this ruler appeared and I thought, hang on a minute, and when I took my fingers off it disappeared and I realized this is actually a shortcut. I don't think it's really explained very clearly anywhere in particular, but when you're drawing, say you're drawing you know, a picture in notes on your iPad Pro, simply just put two fingers down, okay, well, I'll try, if you move your fingers it'll do that. If you um, put two fingers down, you end up with this ruler which shows up temporarily so that you can draw a line, and then when you take your fingers off, it just disappears, which is really, really useful, say, if you were going to just throw down a simple horizon line, or maybe if you were going to use it as guides for, I don't know, drawing a drawing a box, if I can <laughs> draw a box correctly. Uh, at the moment, I'm, I'm actually recording with an iPad Pro to record an iPad Pro, so uh, I'm, I've never done this before, and kind of finding it a little difficult to have my arms coming around an iPad Pro to draw on one. But if you just bear with me, uh, you can see this is actually a really useful tool for drawing. <laughs> yeah, it's so hard to draw with an iPad in my way. Uh, it's a really useful tool because the ruler, usually you would have to click down here to activate the ruler, set it in exactly the place you want it, draw the line, and then you know, switch it off. But now you can just have this quick shortcut, draw a nice vertical line, take it off, and it's done. So I hope you enjoyed that neat little tip for the iPad Pro. It makes it really, really easy to use the ruler without having to activate it. And if you like to use both hands while drawing, you know, one to measure things out and zoom in and out, and the other one to draw with, it's a really useful tip. Anyway, uh, I hope you enjoyed that. See you next time.